All right, so I wanted to do a real quick example here uh, looking at SQL. So SQL, some people know it, some people know it well, some people know it all right, uh, and sometimes it can get pretty pretty squirrely. So uh, here what we have is we have a connection that's hitting a Microsoft SQL Server database, and let's just assume that I don't know what this SQL means. Uh, what I might do is copy this and then move over to ChatGPT and paste it in here and say explain. And we'll just try to get this to explain what that SQL does. And so the immediately it starts, it starts coming up and telling me what it's doing. And it tells me that it's selecting uh, from a particular column, from the table. It's telling me that the where clause is being used for data retrieval or data, yeah, data retrieval. And then it's telling me what this function does. And so uh, this is pretty interesting. So this could be helpful if I do have SQL that I don't understand. I could come and put it in here and try to get a better understanding for what it's doing. Um, but what if I was moving from a SQL Server database to an Oracle database as an example? Uh, I'm going to try something else. So let's try to say convert SQL from MS SQL to Oracle SQL. And we'll put that in there. Let's see what that comes up with. And so it uh, it's, thinks for a little bit and it says, here's the equivalent SQL in Oracle. And uh, I've, I've double checked this, it is correct. Uh, so I can copy that and I could come over here and could paste it in. And obviously I would have to change this to my Oracle connection and then test it. But uh, interesting, just an additional way to utilize uh, chat GPT if you're working with in database connections or SQL data and you're moving from one database to another or you don't understand what it's doing um, again one more way to consider using chat GPT as you're building things in Alteryx so hopefully that was helpful if you guys need anything else or want to bounce any ideas off of us uh, you can always reach out, out to us at Capitalize thanks so much